excited and honored. I'm excited and honored. Excited excited and excited. honored. <laughs> I know. I'm um, hold on. Um, uh, on the mic with Mike, would like to say something. The time is 1.41. The program is, as she said, on the mic with Mike, WJFN Radio, 100.5, 92.7, 820 AM. Uh, we're here with these ladies who are groundbreakers or game changers out there on the battlefield of business. Right. I like that. So, um, yeah. Okay, wow. so here... Talk a little bit about when you realized that your brand was out. And Tiffany, you said, and Angel, I know you said it. When people started talking about your brand, you know, before they knew you. Um, actually, mine just started happening. I just told my husband, I was like, oh, my God, somebody reached out to us. Like, <laughs> we heard of you already before. <laughs> so I was like, yes, yeah, this Sunday. We were at a, de- a market, and uh, some lady was raining hard, and we are set up at the tent. She drives her car around to my booth and was like, yeah, I have to get this tea. <laughs> and I was like, and it was just by word of mouth, mm-hmm. you know, or uh, I'm starting to get a lot of followers on Instagram. So I never know who's who, you know, not only say, say, oh, I, I bought stuff at you at Dory Park or something like that. So, yeah, um, I'm That's excited. Exciting. Yeah, it is mm-hmm. because I'm like, hey. We got people looking for us, you know. <laughs> and you mentioned you mentioned the dessert, David. You mentioned that you you still surprised by how many people know you. Know I brand. am, yeah. I, um, but just like Tiffany, I have been blessed to have grown through word of mouth and just referrals. I um, I, I did um, the first party in the box for a friend of mine at the beginning of COVID, and it got picked up. Um, by one of the news anchors here Mm -hmm. and they featured it on the news and that was a really um it was a really awesome feeling